all right and welcome back to another elden ring video um now <laughs> as of now I'm, I'm still not really sure where to go honestly um it's been about like a couple of weeks maybe like two weeks and a half since i last played this uh most of my time you know was basically spent editing the other like 20 videos that i had out because the those videos i kind of recorded within like a nice weekly span so they're, they're um they were a lot closer together time span wise whereas now um it's <laughs> it's, it's it's taking some time to to get things together um but yeah like i said i don't know where to go so i'm just kind of still discovering new caves to explore so like this one i think it said what they say like ansel something <laughs> um i hope everyone's doing well you know, if you're watching the video i hope everything's cool on your end Ansel river well depths okay uh i mean as you can see i, I kind of changed up the the look of my character and just his build uh, i went for a dex bleed build i know i know yeah dex <laughs> but um the build before the faith build it it was just kind of slow for me personally and uh i, I feel like this build now is it's faster you know it's i feel like it's more versatile uh, i still want to incorporate some more i guess skills because right now i only have flame grant me strength and golden vow and i'm using the oh uh dragon communion talisman instead of the other one um but yeah uh another dungeon i'm not sure how long this video is gonna be so it might be short like, like a good 15 minutes kind of think of it as like a filler episode of <laughs> of, a, of an of an anime that's all this is but um i still gotta do some research on like where to where I'm supposed to be going and all that, so I hope you enjoy the ride. Yeah, this this build is so much faster. Um, I changed the build today. So like when I say today I mean like uh like 30 minutes ago. Just to try something new. I've always wanted to incorporate katanas into my build and I'm not even done with the build itself. I need to Another Ucha Katana. I need another one in my right hand so I can, um... I can bleed myself to get a, an attack boost. Instead of having, um, one, one sword boosting my attack, I should be having two, but... I think I have to, uh... Go to New Game Plus to, to get the other Ucha Katana, or have someone else just give me theirs. There was a whole video on this build. It's like the vampire build. I'm like, well, hey, I fucking love vampires. <laughs> you know, why not? I think so. Okay. Uh, here, let me. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> what? You got zombie ants here now? Okay. Uh, I'm still kind of working on. Uh, the audio and everything, because it's still... My mic's still saying that it's, like, dipping into the, the red. It's kind of weird. Alright, sorry about that. I was looking at my OBS uh, audio meter, and it was dipping into the reds and stuff, so... I had to decrease the gain on that. Hopefully it's... it's um, I'm still... <laughs> uh, heard pretty clearly, I hope. Oh, shoot. Some of these guys are, like, hurt already. Hold on. Did I miss a turn over here? I like I missed a turn. Oh, okay. It just didn't lead anywhere. Uh, some parts of me feel like I, I've already been here. Or at least I've been to a... I've been here from just another direction. Are these bodies? <laughs> yeah, it just it just seems similar to a, an area I've already visited. I think it's on three. Yeah, so this is a an early dungeon I just missed. 
I turned up the audio for the game too. So hopefully everything we heard. Uh, I think the here, let me check. It should speech. Yeah, voice is 10. Yeah, everything should be fine. Before I was I was editing videos before, man, and I couldn't hear anyone like I could barely hear any of the NPC speak. Oh, this is the queen. Holy crap. I I couldn't imagine like shrinking down to a size of an ant and just going through their caves and tunnels and networks just to get rid of the queen so they wouldn't so they can't spawn anymore <laughs> really popped her like a balloon oh she can be a ruin But yeah, I love this build, man. Like anytime I get a kill off or hit people, I just heal. So it's like, it's essentially the same build I had before, but it's just quicker and stronger. I had to take off uh, some of the armor I had too, just so I could uh, uh, move a bit faster. So now my light, my equipment load is uh, light now, instead of it being medium, which, you know, medium is not bad. It's just, I, I want to move quicker, you know? Old Palace Ruins. Oh wow! <laughs> oh, look, I can summon my my mimic. I, I I think I'm gonna hold off on that for now at least. Oh, uh, those oh those those are just just guys. I thought they look like werewolves. Yeah, Smith and Stone Forest. Celestial do. We worry of orb. Okay. Yeah, I think the only thing I'm missing from this actual like outfit is the helmet. It's the white. What the hell? It's the white mask. Oh gosh, helmet. Hold on. It's the white mask helmet, which I think increases attack by like 10 or 20% uh, with bleed damage. So, like, basically, anytime I do this, uh, do. and I mind you, I'm, I'm just now like figuring all this stuff out. <laughs> I wasn't really researching builds and stuff before, I was just kind of playing through the game, my own leisure, you know. Yeah, if I, if I do the Seppuku move, it should boost my attack damage by like 10, 20%. That's if I had the mask though. Since I don't have it, I'm just doing 10% or 20% less. I mean, still pretty strong, but... You know, it's alright. I think the more points I put in the dexterity, uh, I should be doing more damage, which I had to respect. <laughs> so my faith isn't at level 90 anymore. Everything's kind of evened out, but my strength and dexterity is still kind of up there. I think they're at like level 60. Uh, I'm also doing my best with the this rendering effect of the videos too. Um, uh, things should be clearer, but you know, with YouTube, they, they compress a lot of the, the graphics. So it doesn't look as good as it, it should. So like like when I'm editing and I, I, I like open up the, the finished the finished product on my computer it looks like fantastic looks flawless everything's smooth but then when i upload it and then watch it on youtube it's like there's a bit of a downgrade there but it's not like too bad <clears throat> it's definitely a lot better than the stuff i've been uploading for a minute am i going up here i kind of want to see what's up here <laughs> but uh, I, I don't know if it's just obs i feel like obs is fine i'm not really sure what else i should be using i have nvidia but i <laughs> I don't really like using it. 
I don't know if it'd be better than OBS, but I, I just don't know. Uh, okay, this is the second part of the, the dungeon, so. Okay. I don't want to rest right now. So, could this be a house? <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna go back down and check the other side real quick. So just give me a sec. Oh, forgot this. Golden room. These are these items don't mean anything to me anymore. <laughs> With the stone one, are you kidding? Now right, let's check this way. No, I, I had to take uh, apart my my controller, which is an Xbox Elite version 2. And um, <laughs> you think, you know, something that costs like 100 bucks, like $130, it'd be, I don't want to say perfect, but it'd be more durable than what it is. I had to take it apart because there's like this, this clanging sound in my controller that kept getting stuck in my right trigger, like the trigger button. Uh, like sometimes I'd like pull it, but it wouldn't go. I couldn't pull the trigger all the way So it, it kind of just It gets stuck. So say like if I'm playing a shooter, right? And I pull the trigger to like shoot a, a gun That trigger would be stuck <laughs> And I'd be shooting my gun for like a hot like minute or so Just trying to like loosen whatever got stuck In the trigger so I had to take that apart and it was like this black Oh god, this black rectangular like plastic piece. I don't know where it came from. Uh, I mean, uh, <laughs> it, everything seems to still be working fine, but I'm not sure where that piece came from. So I'm just kind of concerned for the future of this controller, man. I've had it for a good three years, so I don't want to. Oh god. I don't want to switch out just yet. I like taking care of my things. <laughs> Especially electronics. Immunizing orange charm. Oh, wow. Really? I found a charm? Crystal darts. I actually don't even need to be picking these up. I still need to uh, find some of the bells, but... Yeah, once I find all the bells, I'll, I'll be, like, farming ruins and just trying to get as many of those uh, somber smithing stones, regular smithing stones, and the flowers as I can. Oh, this looks like a boss area. Not a boss, but no, an, an elite character, someone that's like, like big or something. Like why would they have this area if it's like, it's like nothing here besides two flowers? Still no. Okay. Likely a giant. Visions of underground tomb. Holy, what the fuck? <laughs> what <laughs> is going on? Is that one of the the fingers? Not the fingers, but the. Dragon Ken Soldier of <laughs> Ah
Yeah, this is definitely working out a lot better. Oh shit. Hold on. Alright, uh, get up! <laughs> Surprise that didn't hit me. Oh. Oh. oh my god. I got it! No! Oh. If my mimic is a beast. Frozen light. What? There's frozen versions of the lightning spear? Achievement. And I got an achievement too. Okay. I honestly didn't think this was a spot I needed to go for an achievement. Oh, there's a... Oh, okay. Hold on. So, I, I'm going to backtrack. Ah, see, this is why I wish I had a, a better memory. Because I don't know what the name of the other, other grace was. <clears throat> what was the name of that grace? Okay, so... What? Not that one. Okay. <laughs> I had to let my dog out, man. <laughs> uh, my door is wide open. I don't know why he needs me to, like, take him out. Like, he could literally just step out outside and just <laughs> do his business without me being there. I don't know why that is. Okay, so this is where I need to be, I think. Um, yeah, that's how I got to the other race okay. oh what's i supposed to be coming from this spot up to oh, oh my god not me going the opposite way uh i guess it's a good thing because you know that that way i can i guess quote unquote backtrack and get the items i need or not really need but yeah see i don't really need all that it's just nice to have i guess even though these aren't really needed for me anymore <clears throat> the more the better. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. Oh, my God. It's just one of the paths I didn't take before. All right. Give me a second. <laughs> going back. I'm going back. Okay. I had no idea. I had no idea. Now that we're on the right track. Hmm. What is this? Ooh. Is this gonna be a somber smith this time? A great ghost cloak. So was this the whole area? I mean, if I had to guess, yeah, because I did get an achievement after killing the boss. What's actually? What's wait? What's down there? Um. Still a waterfall basin. I mean, if this was it, I'm surprised there was no, there was no golden fog before this area. Look carefully, visions of grace. Um. Oh wow! Did he just draw? <laughs> he tried it. <laughs> Alright, so tell you what, I'm gonna, uh, I guess, try to explore this area a bit more, and like, if I come up, if I come across a spot uh, I haven't been to yet, then I'll, I'll, uh, you know, you know, I'll transition to that spot, so, <laughs> just give me a sec. Bro, I ain't even gonna cap, <laughs> I forgot to go up these steps, so I probably, <laughs> I'm probably gonna say something like, you know, I can't, I couldn't find anything else. Like at the end of the video, I couldn't find out where else to go, but I totally forgot to go up here. <laughs> Please forgive me. But yeah, at this time I already completed or er, completed the whole dungeon, so I killed the boss. <laughs> I killed the uh what was it, like the Dragon Knight or something like that? Some guy that can't really like get on his feet. And he was using like Ice lightning or something. Yeah, all that's done. This is. <laughs> ah. This is uh, Velcrith after he ended the video. So, 
It's just me coming back and exploring the, the, the steps. I think I went immediately to the left and I just kind of went off from there. So again, I do apologize. <laughs> oh my god, this is I wonder how this is going to look like afterwards. <laughs> it's going to be so goofy. With the power of editing, everything should turn out fine though. this whole but you know i've been playing a lot of fortnite man and i never thought i'd enjoy it as much as i as much as i have been ever since epic kind of dropped gears of war well specifically i think i think did they make judgment i forget i think they stopped at judgment but i think every game uh after judgment i just i couldn't get into man and then that's when they kind of drifted on the Fortnite. <laughs> like Epic, they, they just haven't really been the same for me, which is a good thing, you know, because, you know, people change and, you know, things change. And I think they, they're racking in more revenue from Fortnite. And I can honestly say I can see why. <laughs> they, they have a lot of things up there that's like literally for everybody, like no matter what the age group is. Answer properly. A new map has been. Oh wow, there's like is, is this the boss area right here? <laughs> um but yeah, uh they they I, I recently bought a a Wu Tang emote. <laughs> this shit's awesome. What is this guy doing here? There's someone there. A customer. Well, how long has it been? That's really here by all by himself. Ooh. Oh, this is where you get the prisoner outfit, okay. I mean, granted, you can start off as a prisoner and get the outfit like that. I always wondered where you actually bought the outfit. Let's buy everything off of him. It's off, I'm oh, being summoned. Ooh. Bonus clips. <laughs> Rapping. <laughs> oh. Excellent name. Excellent name. Okay, so invaded. Okay, that that's the it. <laughs> that's it for that. <laughs> and I think um, the last bit of exploration, I'm gonna explore the right side. And I'm hoping the right side leads to another area too. Was that a was that a beetle I just saw? Or is that a phantom? Oh, golden centipede. <laughs> I have no idea what these are used for. Whoa! Oh my god. Swing and a miss. My face. You guys drop. Clayman's harpoon. Honestly, I can't wait for my second run through this. Absolutely gonna enjoy it. Oh, well, that's all the enemies. I'm surprised, like... Now, I, I probably can't remember, but I have not... I don't think I've been, like... Uh, I don't think I've been near Waterfall and it not have, like, a hidden path through it in this game yet. I'm not sure. Uh, I probably have, but it's just been a minute. Usually, any game I play and it has a Waterfall, there's a secret right behind it. <laughs> I'm talking mainly about Skyrim, but... Uh, I think this is the whole cave now now that i come back and you know explore it thoroughly i'm not sure if we can get up there or not but um yeah uh off to i guess past velcrit to end the video <laughs> well i tried my best to uh find more i guess more uh, uh i guess past throughout this area uh, i can't find anything man i guess uh yeah that that's it for this <laughs> um uh, real quick, before I, I uh, end this one, I want to show show you guys the uh, the build I got going. It's uh, obviously, you know, the Rivers of Blood, the most hated <laughs> sword in the game. I feel like it's like the most hated sword right next to the Moon Bell. Like, as of right now, I guess. Uh, a Blood Uchi Katana maxed out. Uh, the build consists of two Uchi Katanas. 
for the uh the seppuku uh ash of war to buff uh the uh, the, the attack uh, i'm still not 100 percent on on all the details and stuff yeah just like i said i, I just kind of made the build but doing seppuku kind of boosts your attack for the blood loss so if you have two chukitanas and use it twice it, you're gonna yeah boost um dragon communion seal uh you don't have to use this you can use any seal for the uh mir miracles uh for the spells that you <laughs> that you have uh as for the armor the only thing that's really important is the helmet but i don't have the helmet because i killed mog already and you have to kill uh two of the the white the white mass invaders i forget their names but they, he drops a white mask including his whole armor set and really the helmet is what you want because it boosts your attack or like blood or something like that everything else is fine uh but then you want for the equipment routed wing sword insignia which greatly raises attack power with successive attacks you know obviously with the with the the um whereas a blood it has that combo that combo move so consecutive attacks you know increases attack power uh lord of blood's exhaustion which i got today earlier blood loss in vicinity increases attack power so again with the seppuku you use it twice it'll increase now i'm i'm, I'm guessing it works for you too but but I, I also think it works if you blood loss an enemy so it just keeps stacking uh taker's cameo restores hp upon defeating enemies this is pretty sweet and Godskin Swaddling Cloth. Successive attacks restore HP, which is pretty sweet too. Kind of like the Molina fight. <coughs> when she hits you, she heals up. It's, it's basically like that. And um, yeah, that, that's pretty much it for uh, this video. Uh, if you enjoyed it, man, go ahead and leave a like, you know, comment, sub, whatever. Uh, I will be doing more, but pop the next video will probably be uh, some something towards end game i just still have to do research on it <laughs> this it's like i stopped playing for a couple of weeks and i forget where i am so i'm gonna have to online google all this stuff and beat the game eventually because you know all good things must come to an end but uh yeah it's gonna be it for this one i hope you guys enjoyed it and uh adios